discuss about how to deal with mild and moderate symptoms of COVID-19. We have a chest care protocol that helps in relieving the mild and moderate symptoms of COVID-19. As COVID-19 has a major effect on the respiratory systems of protocol, so chest care needs to be very essential for dealing with the symptoms. The first step in the chest care protocol is steam inhalation. It is helpful in the patients with minor symptoms. The patient performs steam inhalation for two to three times a day. Then the second step in the chest care protocol is breathing exercises. We have two types of breathing exercises, diaphragmatic and pursed lip breathing. These breathing exercises are beneficial to remove the secretions, to loosen the mucus and help in strengthening the respiratory muscles. It also proves beneficial in improving the chest and thoracic spine mobility. Diaphragmatic exercises are performed by the patient himself. He just places his hands over the stomach area or the abdomen region and will breathe in and breathe out. As the patient breathes in and out, he will feel the rise and fall of the abdomen with his hands. This technique should be performed for 3 to 5 minutes per session and again twice or thrice a day. Then we have pursed lip breathing. It is also a very simple technique of breathing exercises, but it is very beneficial in improving the strength of the respiratory muscles. This technique is performed when we breathe in slowly and deeply through our nose and exhale out slowly through the pursed lips. These techniques are followed by the third step that is the postural drainage. Now postural drainage include a variety of positions. The patient will position himself in a variety of positions depending upon different lobes or which lobe of the lung is affected by the mucus secretions. There are different positions in the postural drainage that will aid or help prove beneficial in draining out the secretions into the larger airways. There are different positions. First is the sitting position. In the sitting position, patient places a pillow behind his back. Next position is the supine line position. When the patient lies flat on his back and a pillow is placed under the head and one pillow is under the hips and the legs of the patient are elevated to 45 degrees. Then we have a prone position when the patient lies with his head downwards and a pillow is placed under the abdomen region. So these positions should be assumed by the patient for 15 to 25 minutes per session and should be performed twice or thrice a day. This postural drainage is followed by chest percussion and vibrations. This procedure will be helpful in draining out the loosened secretions from the affected areas of the lungs. Chest percussion is performed by cupping the hand in a cup manner. We will uh, shape our hand like a cup and then we will strike on the cupped hand on the patient's chest wall. We will strike him continuously, rhythmically manner and it will be continued for 5 to 10 minutes per session. Thank you.